What's up YouTube, this is ZagG here from ZagG Outdoors again, and today it's you're going to be watching a video of me creek fishing at a little place that my cousin had showed me, uh, or cousin-in-law, or whatever you want to call that. And basically just going to be going after some bass that I can see since the water is like gin clear and you can pretty much uh, just see them straight in the water and stuff. So I'm going to be doing a little bit of sight fishing, bed fishing, kind of action kind of stuff. And essentially what happened is that I caught one fish, the male, three times off the bed. I don't have the first time unfortunately because my software isn't rendering it but I got the other two times and then I also caught the female which is a four pounder and unfortunately didn't get her on footage at all because the GoPro is off but you know I'll try to show a picture or do whatever I can for that but uh yeah it was a lot of fun um and I got some more videos coming up this rest of the week so enjoy this and look forward to the video on Friday. All right, thank you. There we go. Oh my god. Oh no. Oh. Oh my god. Could have been the biggest fish of my life right there. God dang it. Is he back on the. Oh, there he is right there again. There we go. Got him, got him again. Same fish. I'm pretty sure this is the same one. Yeah. Yep, it is. I'm get a picture of this little guy. This big guy. See? What? Yeah. The big one's sitting right there now. I see him. I got some. Sauce on That's what I'm thinking too. Big one's right up next to the line. He's sitting there, you know, he's... Ooh, snake. Okay, that's not good. Uh, that's a big snake. Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm gonna go get my crap and move it. Oh my god! <laughs> Third times in a row! <laughs> yep. I didn't even hook it this time. He had it in his mouth and shaking it around. I was like, oh, it's not coming out. Third time in a row. No way that's a one. That's gotta be at least two or three. That is crazy. I've never done that before. Well, that's a nice one. Yeah. Well, I just got the big one. It's four pounds. I'll probably just show a picture of it. God, man. Finally, after I missed him on the swim jig, I got him on the regular jig. What was that? What did you catch it on? Cut it on this. Flipping jig right here. It's a Strike King flipping jig. I'm got to hook and I got the Zoom Swim, well, Super Chunk Chartreuse. Didn't get on camera, but I will show a picture. What is up, YouTube? Now we're here at the gear review for this last video. It's basically going to go over what kind of stuff I use to catch my fish and how I actually fished it. So, rod and reel is my same Shakespeare Ugly Stick Elite rod, 7 foot, medium heavy. Bass action tip on it. Then I got the reel, which is a Bass Pro Pro Qualifier reel, uh, 6 one with a 30 pound braid on there. And the lures. Um, so, first, what I catch the male, what I caught the male bass on all three times was this uh, Strike King Hack Attack Swim Jig or Heavy Cover Swim Jig. Um, and that, what I just did is uh, just bounce it on top of its bed and let the fish suck it up. And then, whenever it started, had it in its mouth and then started taking off with it, then I said the hook just to do little quick pops and bounces and stuff and then what I caught the big fish on was this uh, Strike King Hack Attack Jig which is just regular kind of flipping jig kind of stuff and green pumpkin 
and this is just in a uh, white color where I put a little bit of chartreuse on the tail there. I also put chartreuse on the uh, appendages for this, but I'm not sure if it's the exact same one. But same kind of thing. I would just throw this up to next to the cover and then swir uh, slowly work it back. Just pop it a couple times and let it sit there. Pop it a couple times and let it sit there. And uh really seemed to work out really well. I was surprised. It's given that gin clear water and stuff. It worked out um, perfectly. And... Uh, Hopefully I can do some more uh, creek fishing here pretty soon too. There's my big old cat right there. I'm so happy, Danny. Uh, but yeah, uh, this so and that's gonna be the gear review for this video today. Uh, got got all the kind of gear that we used here and the actual specific um, gear and all of its names and specification stuff will be in the description for the video just in case I did not cover it here. So thank you for watching this and have a good rest of your day.